See, maybe God's given you a dream, but it doesn't mean those around you have the dream. Doesn't mean they won't soon come on board with the dream and have a dream and get on the vision, but maybe they don't have it yet. You see, your dream will need your faith. We went to Canberra a couple of months after that, Kenny and I, and we were still sort of having these tension conversations about this dream and what that looked like. And so we went to Canberra for visa reasons for Kenny's family with Bulgaria. And we were down there and, and we said, you know what, tonight let's have a night off. We're not talking about South Africa. We're having a night off. We said, yep, we're okay, we both agreed. We're not going to mention it, talk about it. It's a night off. So we thought we're going to go out on a little romantic date again. You know, I was thinking I'm going to have the steak, she'll have the chicken. And so, so we go out now, but the only thing is we're in Canberra, people. Pretty much nothing stays open after 5 p.m. in Canberra. <laughs> and so we didn't know where to go. We couldn't find any restaurants open. We searched every street we were walking, and then we finally found a restaurant that was open. And we're like, finally, one's open. Let's see if we can get in. The restaurant's packed. We get in. We said, do you have a table for two? He says, yes, we have a table for two. So we're like, oh, we got in. So we sit down. We're having this nice food, and, and the food's coming. The food was incredible. And I'm thinking, this is such beautiful food. And Kenny's commenting on the food. We're loving the food. And the waiter comes and I said, excuse me. I said, what cuisine is this food? And the waiter looks and he said, this is South Africa's finest cuisine. <laughs> Kenny and I, we looked at each other. We burst out laughing. You can't run from a God dream. You can't run from a God dream. <laughs> 